guys, welcome to my channel. Today we're going to Costco where I'm gonna shop for my family so you can see what's in my grocery cart. And we're gonna go through thumbs up, thumbs down things at Costco that you should consider purchasing to keep your children well this coming school year. Hey, my name is Dr. Anna Maria Temple and I'm a holistic pediatrician. My specialty is eczema and my mission is to help inspire, educate, and empower you to raise healthy children in this unhealthy world. And we're gonna start with nutrition. Oh, check these things out. Straws. Oh, the fight against plastic. We have metal straws with a clean thingy. Oh, these are amazing. Oh, here we're gonna get some organic mushrooms. And you may think of, oh goodness, who's gonna eat this many mushrooms? Well, not in my family. It's a difficult sell, but it goes into sauces where they don't know. I use a serving size and the rest I freeze and use it, you know, in a week or so. They freeze beautifully. All right, we have Boston lettuce which I know is not organic. It is fantastic for to spice up your salad, also on sandwiches. And we have our organic spring mix with a, a variety of different lettuces in here. So adds about three plant points. And my latest find is this organic crunch chop salad, which I'm only gonna use the vegetables because it's gonna increase my plant points. But check this out. Romaine, chicory, broccoli, cauliflower, red cabbage, Feta, we're not going to use carrots, um, and I'm not using the dressing. Anyway, increases your plant points. A handful of this into this. Boom. Oh, look at this. Just found these guys. They are almond flour siete tortillas. Let's look at the ingredients. Check this out. Love these guys. Look at this price. You can also freeze these and use as needed. Which coffee you may wonder that we get. We get the Charleston Organic Signature Coffee Blend. My favorite snacks after work is guacamole with a plantain chips that are from Costco. Okay, other things in our basket are this seasoning. Um, love this organic no salt seasoning. My husband makes homemade salad dressing by chucking this into some uh, organic olive oil and balsamic vinegar, a little bit of salt, done. The peanut butter that we eat is this, also from Costco as well. Ingredients, as you can see, organic peanuts, sea salt. Ooh, I'm spying contraband in this basket. And one of my sons, who's still at home, loves these chips, but notice the contraband is in a basket that is filled with organic fruits and vegetables, tons of plant points. So, you know, once in a while we have the no-no. He gets this once a month and he has to divide it up in portion sizes so he can make it last all month long. All right, for my personal care, I used of Sensitive Skin, which is actually a two on the Think Dirty app. And my skin really loves Cetaphil. It's a five, but my, hate, my skin hates everything else. So this is what I use for my personal care. My cheese of choice is this organic feta from Kirkland. It's made with sheep milk, fantastic. Great snack idea is using salsa and they have an uh, awesome organic brand that is filled with just lots of vegetables and some vinegar. I gotta get my plant points in my smoothies in the morning, so I gotta get my strawberries, my mega dose smoothie pack, the uh, pineapple chunks, cherries, and of course we have to have seeds because they're packed with fiber, protein, and omega-3s. I get to make my own bone broth, so I do use a Costco brand. Here's all the ingredients. Um, and this is a great, as another great family snack, the pistachios. Now, in here, we will see that it does have some dextrose, so we know it's got a bit of added sugar, which is so annoying, but these are, yep. So they're not the best, but they will do. I hope this was a helpful video, seeing what I'm grocery shopping for for this week. Don't forget to leave me comments and suggestions on what stores and what are the things we should be shopping for. I'm thinking Walmart snacks next. Anyway, I do have an awesome book, The Rule of Five, available on Amazon, A Parent's Guide to Raising Healthy Kids in This Unhealthy World, to help you with simple steps on getting your kids back to school safely. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and I will see you guys next time.